Hello guys, what's going on? King Flipper here and welcome to another showdown SBC. Today we have two showdowns, well the obviously showdown is obviously two different cards. It is in the era diversity, it's PSV versus Ajax. We're going to start off with the Ajax player, Kaliba, I hope I've said that right. And his card, it literally is now the best Netherlands right back in the whole game without even being upgraded. So, you know, most people are pretty much going to do this. This card looks disgusting. Um... 85 rated right back with 92 pace, 70 shot, 81 passing, 83 dribbling, 84 defensive, 91 physicality for a right back, excuse me. Uh, six foot high medium work rates, three start, two start, and as I said, if this does get upgraded, where would you like to start? Uh, we got 93 acceleration with 91 sprint speed. Rapid, well, that's what we like to see. Shooting stats and bad. 75 attack positioning, 60 finishing, of course, it's not going to be amazing. 88 shot power and 80 long shots, because why not? 60 volleys, naff, and penalties, naff. Passing stats, though 81 visions, 81 crossing, 74 free kick accuracy, it's not bad. Uh, 86 short passes, 75 long passing, and 80 curve. Again, really good for a right back. Dribbling stats 84 dribbling. 84 dribbling, 84 agility with 84 balance, nice, reactions of 85, ball control of 85, dribbling of 80 and composure of 86, again really good for a right back, uh, defensive stats, 81 inceptions, 77 head characters is not the best, uh, 85 defensive awareness, 87 stand tackle, 84 slide tackle, <laughs> then you get into his physicality stats and yeah, mm, 78 jumping, what, how, what, how old was he, 5 foot 10, 6 foot, it's not, it's not that bad to worry, 99 stamina, beautiful, 88 strength with 90 aggression. Okay then. Uh, what was his player traits? Anything good? Early crosser. Uh, not really make much difference, but you know. Um, the Malin is pretty much the, the same type of requirements, just a different variation in the format. In the formation, uh, apart from instead of Netherlands player, it's an irreversible. But obviously, if you want to go and check that out, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Make sure you got that notification bell on because I will update, it, upload it as soon as I've done this one. Um, so for Caliber, Re Caliber, sorry, Caliber, uh, Caliber requirements. You do need one Netherlands player, as you can see. I've got Van der Beek there in the CDM position. Team over on eight of eight four. We're bang on eight four. Can't lower anyone else. Uh, team chemistry of 60, take the three loyal players off. We are smack bang on 60, no position changes or loyalty. Just a crap ton of strong links. Uh, yes, just a crap ton of strong links uh, and 11 players in squad. Before we get into it, just to let you know, these are foot been by, by now, price of time in SBCs, which has been out for about 20 25 minutes. Bits and snops will, of course, always be cheaper, and don't forget, prices do fluctuate. So, uh, as I was saying, I've gone Premier League because of Van der Beek, because you do need that Netherlands player. Uh, I was going to go Era Diversity, and it's just there's no point uh, for this one. Um, this uh, Van der Beek is the cheapest 83 rated uh, Netherlands player. Anyhow, um, everyone, as I said, is Premier League, apart from Lopez, who I could sneak in there, and because he's cheap, uh, I got away with it. So we'll get him to it. So we'll start with Leno. Leno is 14k at the moment, according to Footbin, which is not bad. Uh, Pereira is 16k, of course, a bit more because he's obviously 85 rated right back. Uh, Lopez, as I said, from the French League, I got him there because he's Portuguese, I can fit him in here. 1.3k, nice. I'll save myself some money there, thank you. The Bravka, 1.3k is the cheapest 83 rated player in the Prem. Schmeichel is the cheapest 84 rated player at the moment in the Prem, so you can throw in either him and Diddy or Patricio, whichever one's cheaper, or you might have a fodder one in just throwing there, 6.6k. Then we, all of the 83 midfielders are pretty much the cheapest as you can go. Martino is 2.2k. Van der Beek, of course, you're paying a bit more because he is what you need, which is 3k. Um, uh, I throw in Pepe there to give me some more uh, a chemistry boost because obviously is an 80. You need you can get away with 182 rated player in this one, and he's a right mid and 950 coins. If you can't, if Pepe does go up in price, you can use William as well, which makes a little bit of difference. You might have to go for uh, play around then. Uh, Kovacic because he's in left mid position is 2.8k. Uh, Ziyech is the cheapest cam. There's uh, you can use him more Havertz, but Ziyech is cheaper. He's 15k. And Deli Ali again is the next cheapest. Uh, 83 rated player in the Prem at 3.2k. Um, I don't know if you can throw him in. Yeah, you can probably put Lopez up front and then move Mati. You can, as again, there's a lot of different ways you can use. There's in DD, Patricio. You've got Neves Rodriguez you can use instead of Pepe if you can try. Uh, there is another way you can go with this SBC and you can use 286 rated uh, instead of the 85s, but that's about 10k more, which I was kind of surprised at. Uh, no, it's about 9k difference. So this way, 66.35k 66k for a card like that that doesn't and it might get upgraded i mean 
Ajax PSV, I mean, that's a big game. We know what that game's like in the Eredivisie. You know it's the biggest game in the Eredivisie. What's your predictions, guys? What do you think in the What do you think is going to be in the comments below? But pff, also, what do you think that this card, 66k, it's an absolute bargain, absolute bargain for a right back. Um, so there we go, SBC all done. Hopefully, of course, I did save you some time and some money. If you did, feel free to drop a thumbs up. It does, of course, help the channel and the video. Obviously, as I said, if you want to see the other showdown video, uh, mailing, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Make sure you got that notification bell on so you can keep up to date as soon as I upload these. But other than that, thank you very much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video stream. Take it easy, and obviously, peace.